Spiral hog. I'm really hungry. Can I get a pizza delivered to me whilst on this train? I started by calling pizza restaurants in towns that I was going to be passing through. Um, do you do delivery to a train station? Initially, they didn't love the idea. No, no. I wouldn't be able to do that. Rats. Eventually, I got a bite. We can do that. <laughs> you can. And placed my order for one large pineapple pizza, please. I only had one shot at this, and as I paid over the phone, it's not there. I've just lost. Bro, this is our old people scroll TikTok, is it? What the fuck? Okay, that's insane. Also, why would you ever need to be that good at shooting? Like, I feel like this is not a transferable skill. Like, what are you shooting like that? I found out why. This guy hates birds, bro. He fucking, dude, he literally hates, no bird, not a single bird in sight. He, he will fuck your drone up. You come near him with a drone, dude, this guy's got it. He's, he will destroy it. I found out why legally they have to say, do not try this at home anytime you see a dangerous stunt on TV. A few months ago, I ran a chess boxing event. You don't have to know the specifics, but basically, it's this. Big shots landed for both fighters, so... Oh, oh, if we hit 5 million subscribers, I'll do another chess boxing event. Anyway, I thought everything was going great after the event, until I looked at my subreddit, and I saw somebody post this. We had a chess boxing tournament in an abandoned factory. Because of my chess boxing event, they decided to make a fight club in a concrete warehouse with a bunch of teenagers in zero oversight. Kind of badass, but also brain dead stupid. Why is Ludwig incriminating himself and for for literally like six hundred and thirty eight thousand likes on a fucking YouTube short? This man literally one violated the first rule of Fight Club. Duh! Don't talk about Fight Club. Like second rule, always kiss your opponent. Everybody knows that. Um. And this dude, this dude for, for, for 600,000 likes and like, I would suspect like 25 cents in revenue was like, fuck it, YOLO. I'm putting myself out there to be sued potentially. Stupid. And that's why I found out why legally. This is Kill him, I'll give you money. How much? What's the bounty on me team killing this guy and looking at his reaction? Five bucks? Too low. This is a special gamer right here. Come on, guys, we gotta go. 200k GP. We're talking in GP, I'm on it. Stop fucking shooting me. What the fuck is wrong with you? Chill. It was a miss. Oh my god, that's Baltimer. That's a Baltimer. Yo, he shot someone from Baltimer, dude. Input, oh. miss input. Calm down. You calm the fuck down. Oh, There's a miss input. Oh my fucking god. God, this community is overreacting. Kill oh my fucking god, dude. Hiya. Uncle Roger, I can't wait to see if you can actually cook. Of course I can. We scored the fish, stuffed the cavity with garlic, ginger, Thai basil, seasoned the fish with kosher salt, forgotten. Just kosher salt, not enough. You also need the make shit good thing of flavor, the cocaine of cooking. MSG for you. Leave it in there for 10 minutes. Thank you for your cookbook, Gordon. <laughs> he said, this guy makes fake accents? Wait, really? That's crazy, man. Dude, I had no idea. I thought he, he, I thought he spoke like a, I thought he spoke like a Chinese man from the 70s in a fucking American TV show. Like, that's what I, like, unironically, I thought that's what, Not even Chinese. No, I'm, but I'm saying that, like, <laughs> I'm hearing it's satire. <laughs> yeah. No, I mean, he's pretty funny, by the way. I really, I really like his uh, shit. I, I like a lot of his stuff. But. But to be honest, Scott, this toy even looked like cookbook hiya. It just looked like some random middle-aged guy going traveling. I would never eat that. It's fish. One dollar or anything in the store. Yo. 
Um, anything in the store. Quick. Anything in the store. All right. You mean like anything? All right, bro. You good? What is this for? You're freaking me out, bro. Easy. Just take a couple back. Yeah. Like, this is actually for real. Ten more seconds. You said anything. This. This is what I want. Can I get this? You said anything. Go get the guy. Eat this. Shove it down. <coughs> More? <laughs> Alright, you good to remove that card? And there you are. Appreciate it. You good? Mr. Did you know that it is suggested? I don't even know what the fuck so is this species happening. is the southern yellow. I don't even know. Oh shit, I accidentally saw like a brief snippet so of a dark viper AU a short. Oh god, it's over. It's Jover. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, incoming. Oh no, while I was scrolling, I saw it. Oh no, incoming, dude. He's gonna write like so many pages worth of documents about how much of a piece of shit I am. I'm so sorry. My man, I'm sorry, okay? Uncle Roger got canceled in China. Both Weibo and uh, Bilibili Bili suspended his account. Where are you from? Are you from Boston? Uh, originally from Guangzhou. Guangzhou, China. Uh, yeah. China, okay. China, good country. Good country. <laughs> good country. Good country. <laughs> Woo. We have to say that now, correct? Yo, is he fucking xenophobic? Nah, nah. Oh, their phone listening. Oh, their phone listening. <laughs> This nephew got Huawei phone, they all listening. <laughs> you use ExpressVPN? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. 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 What's going on? Why is everybody wearing the same orange shirts? It's freaking me out a little bit. What the fuck? Don't let your government hear that, please. <laughs> oh, our phone tap into it. Long live presidency. Long live presidency. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Roger, social credit score going up. <laughs> nice. From China. Okay, anyone? Anyone? Any and nephew from Taiwan? <laughs> Not a real country. Not a real. <laughs> Not a real country. I hope one day you rejoin the motherland. One China. Okay, he's. Wait. Yeah, okay, never mind. He's not. <laughs> No, no, don't clap too hard. This is not political show. No, don't clap. <laughs> Uncle Roger gonna get cancelled after tonight. At least it's not cancelled in China. Uncle Roger, okay. Dear CCP, Uncle Roger, good comrade. Good comrade. <laughs> don't make him disappear, please. Truly a comedic genius? What do you... I mean, it's whatever. It's like, do you guys make the same jokes on a daily fucking basis in this chat? Dude, YouTube shorts are mid as fuck. Do you know what time it is? Okay, uh, what year I'm at? 50? Are you sure? Oh my god. Oh, oh no. Fuck me, the machine's broken? It's not working? Oh no. Fuck. I don't know what to do. Do you know what time it is? Okay. You gotta get insight. YouTube is so good. I'm gonna look at TikTok. What is this subway? So takes? what's your take? Androids are the Oh, I've seen this one. This one's actually pretty phone? good. Hundred percent disagree. Androids are the best phone. They have the best battery life. It's all this like idea. Goes back I to love her. I, I I I love her so much. Actually, I love her. I, I, I know that, like, she's saying stuff about iPhone users. I've always been an iPhone user. I make fun of Android users all the time. And, but, like, I don't know why. She's just, she's just sick. She's so fucking cool. Yeah, she said Karl Marx. Yeah, she said Karl Marx would have had an Android. She's right. Yeah. Goes back to Karl Marx, actually, of conspicuous consumption. Wait, who's that? 
how do you live in Brooklyn? And it's like the elitism of having an iPhone. What is it's conspicuous like, consumption? It's like consuming so that other people can see you consume stuff. You don't buy the iPhone because it's the best product. It's actually not. It goes to shit. Like, that's been proven, too. You buy the iPhone to shame Android users. But I'm a free-thinking woman. I don't give a shit what anyone has to say. I don't even agree with that. Like, I don't think you buy an... I don't think you buy the fucking iPhone to shame Android users. That's kind of wild. But I love her. I don't know why. Her vibes are so good. Her vibes are so great. Say about me. You know times I'll meet a guy from Tinder. We go off app. And I don't know, we chat in this and that. As soon as I text him, oh, green text and block me. No. Don't do that. He blocked? Or not blocked, but ghosted. For the green text? For the green text. That is... For the green text. That's discrimination. That's discrimination. That's, That's discrimination. Oppression. Which Android do you have? Admittedly, I have an old one. An Android 10. Where they're on 22 right now. I know. I'm broke. I'm doing bad. But, honestly, I'm killing the game, too. I got my shit on lock. I got my shit popping. With an Android 10... First of all, that's bad status. So you're never going to be team iPhone ever in your life? No, that's you bad know what? Status. Let me tell you something. When the guillotines roll out, iPhone users will go first. Chill. <laughs> yeah, she's wrong. The best phone is the freedom phone, brother. Why is it like, what has happened in the world where like everybody is just like straight up fucking, where did they buy these like little microphones? In all of my life, I've never seen these little microphones, man. I've never seen them. Where did they find these little microphones? Like, what's happening? They're, they're just, like, running around. The lav mic? Yeah, they just... It's a lapel mic? But, but like, what? You just got, like, a lapel mic that you connect to your phone? Because they're filming from their phone, right? Are you kidding? No, I'm not kidding. I don't even 